How's it going guys and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we are joined by a special guest, an ex main <laughs> no, I'm joking. Our special guest is Andy, of course, because we're doing a squad builder showdown. Yay! Hello, hello, hello. Ooh. Yay. I'm doing the ambient uh, crowd noise, Andy, because I, I could Ooh, add it in. I could add it in, but I think Hang it's more authentic. On. If oh, I you want to do it yourself? Hang on. Yeah, wow. Yeah, come on. That's enough cringe for the intro, I reckon. I thought, you know what? We talked about the Great British Bake Off for your intro. I thought I would. What are we going to talk about this time? Britain's best <laughs> home cook. <laughs> Martha Big up Stewart, Mary Berry. Mate. Martha Stewart. <laughs> Oh, but we are doing a squad with a showdown around an ex-Man United player in Memphis Depay. Never really, you know, found his feet at United, I feel like. Never really um, showed what he was capable of. He's gone to Lyon and performed really, really well. Uh, we just did a squad with a showdown on current Man United legend, Marcus Rashford MBE. Make sure you He's check that out. Legend, Link in the be description. He's, uh, do, you reckon, do you reckon Depay's going to be better, Andy? Probably. I think so as well. But, I mean, that's not to spoil anything. Uh, make sure you check out that. Link in the description to that. Uh, I highly recommend going and watching it. It was a very, very... Um, tasty. Interesting episode. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. Tasty is a word. It was, it was... That game was crazy, to be honest. It could have been mental. I think we, we could start straight away and get into some formations if you want to. I mean, I'm not quite familiar with this. I've never done it too many times. But I think that is what we do. <laughs> I'm uh, brilliant. Well, there you go. Formations, uh, I, mate. <laughs> I am, uh, as you can tell, a veteran. Obviously, I know what I'm doing. We we are very good at, uh, at this. Um, but can I am just holding. Address the fact that this board. is a squabble showdown, not on your channel, not on Harry Maguire. Yeah, I know. This is mental. It, it feels weird starting with a like going from the top to bottom as opposed to bottom to top. It's a strange concept. I've never never done it before. <laughs> um, but I'm holding my whiteboard, Andy, with a formation How was Greece, that I think you want to use. Okay, I'll stop making terrible jokes. <laughs> and I will pick... Four, three, three, two. I wrote down... The four three three two. No, I didn't really. I wrote down a four four two. I thought you'd go with the flat, the basic, the uh, the four four two. Um, okay. I'd also like a four three three, Andy. However, the final number in brackets for me would ideally be four. You may have it. I put a kind of technically a version of four three three, but it's four three two one. Interesting. Well, actually, that is a really good formation this year. It's actually, I think a lot of people sleep on that formation every year, but that is a very good formation. Um, but we have pretty much almost an identical formation here, so we can just do the same players. We can. The wingers. For each. The midfielders. Let's, yeah, let's. Do you want to do the wingers first and then midfielders? And then That's the full backs, right? and then the centre backs, and the goalie. <laughs> Welcome to Squabble the Showdown, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I reckon we start with the centre backs, obviously, in. in uh, in awe of Harry Maguire, I reckon we uh, we start we start at the bottom. Is that a good idea? No, not a good no. idea at all. Okay, Terrible well, idea, uh... if I'm being honest with you. <laughs> Almost as bad as putting Harry Maguire into a team on FIFA 21. That Have was, you seen his that stats? That was just uncalled for. That just that was uncalled. He's actually very Almost good. as bad as an idea of paying 80 million pounds for Harry Maguire in real life. Right, okay. Can we go on to the wingers now, please? And, and okay. stop this Harry Maguire slander. I'm starting to take offence. Okay then, Andy. Um... We have, I hope, wingers written down on our whiteboards. I think it's my turn to go first because I'm pretty sure I you went first with the formations. So I am going to kick us off with our with with hopefully my left winger, who I would like to be. This one is a little bit risky as well. I would like it to be Bergvine. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Possibly, maybe not. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, and then at the right winger spot, I would like to go with. A young Jelson Martins from, uh, I think, Monaco? Monaco, Portuguese yep. fella. Okay. Hopefully, hopefully it can happen. I thought, because it was your video on your channel, you were going to go Billy Big Balls and be like, oh, look at me, guys. Coming in, it's the shut out. I'll have Neymar. But you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I did think about it. And then I put Di Maria. Okay. All right. The wrong five-star skiller, unfortunately. 
Is, is Gilson Martin's got five star skills? Because I was just looking at who I want to go for myself on the right hand side. Uh, he does have five star, yeah. I was tempted to go for this Rafinha, you know, just because he technically shouldn't exist, but he does exist, yeah. and I think I've got him. So I think I'm going to go for him. Mm -hmm. And then on the left hand side, I really couldn't decide. There's that informed Bamba. There's obviously Neymar, and I have Neymar as well. There's Bergwijn. But what I'm going to go for is over Mars. Oof. Okay, Andy. Well then. Uh, I wrote down exactly who I went for in Bergwijn and Gelson Martin. So I thought nice. that you'd uh, you'd go something really similar. Um, nice. And no, i be honest with you. I was so scared, even putting in the players I put in in the last episode, that it's... I don't know if I can... I don't know if I've got the bottle to put in, like, a Hullet, for example, or someone like that. I just don't know if I've got it in me. So we'll find out, I think, quite how much bottle I've got as the episode goes on. <laughs> we'll see. Um, but we both have a three-man midfield. So I think we go and do the two... Well, your two CDMs, there's an image in my two centimeters and Cam. I got two centimeters of CDM, just so you write down appropriate guesses. But yes, let's do the three centimeters. Let's do it. Okay then, Andy. So I went first last time. I think it's your turn to go first this time. I've got okay. three names on my whiteboard, and I'm hoping that you want all three of them, and I can get them all off you. Right. I'm going to go on the right-hand side. You know what they say, Haber? What do they say? Some rules are just there to be broken. And I'm not talking about the squabble of the showdown rules because that would be very naughty. I'm going to go for Andre's rule breaker card. Oh, wow. He's literally just came out as well. Eight minutes ago, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I respect it, to be fair. And then I'm going to spice this squad up and go for some French midfielders. I haven't actually fought any further ahead than that. So let me just have a look at who I would like. We'll go... In Dombele and Sissoko. Wow. That is an OP midfield. I love a good perfect link. I wrote down Renato Sanchez, Van der Beek, and Andre. <laughs> no! <laughs> I knew it. I knew it, Andy. No! I thought you'd go down that the route. first rule breaker, hey, but no. <laughs> <laughs> um, who can you have instead? That is the question. I'm thinking a goalkeeper might be a good option here. Um, just wondering, like, I think, like, a small goalkeeper or just someone that's going to be really clunky. One of the two would be really nice. Um, is there any really bad bronze goalies in the Ligue 1 that are French? Because he needs to be French, right? He does. French Ligue 1, please. I'm going to give you Callens because he's got 17 speed and 46 kicking. So I just think he is going to be... Slow, clunky, Unreal. terrible is what I'm hoping. Um, and I'm hoping that you have a really good midfield anyway. So I'm hoping it's going to make a big impact, but it might not do. Like, I won't okay. be surprised if it doesn't. Okay. I am going to go with, on the left, I'm going to go with someone I haven't used in this FIFA yet. A, an interesting one, actually. I'm going to go with uh, Thiago at left centre mid. From Liverpool. Nice. I've got his ones to watch and trade, but I thought I might as well give him a go. Ooh. Now, I've got a saying of my own, Andy. And that saying is go big or go home. So at Cam, I would like Cruyff. That silence is scary. Not as scary as it's going to be for me if I lose this game. Like, I'm actually going to be terrified. Um, and then at left centre mid, I was going to go for Renato Sanchez. However... I'm actually going to go down a different route now, I think. And I'm going to... Oh, actually, after seeing that, maybe not. Um, I was going to go down the Portuguese route, but there's no real, like, amazing Portuguese options here. Um, Which version of Cruyff do you have? I have the middle one. The, the 91 one is 3.6 mil. Yep. You're mental. I know. I am... Um, off my head. Absolutely off my head. Damn, I was going to go down the Portuguese route at right centre mid, but I'm just going to go down Ligan now. I'm going to go for, if I can have him, who am I going to go for here? 
we're going to go for Alex Everton man Idrissa Garner. If I can you have can him. Have him. You can have him. Can I have all three? You can. When you said Thiago, I thought I had a banker for Cam and I put one out because I had one Alden. Yeah, I was going to go, genuinely, if it wasn't Cruyff, it was going to be Wijnaldum. So. And then I had Renato Sanchez. Yeah. And Van der Beek. Mm. Van der Beek. See, I, yeah, I don't know. I was going to go on the right with Andre then to kind of Mug be like, to, yeah, to kind of rub it in. But like, I thought you might have written him down as well. So I'm glad I can have all three, but I am now genuinely panicking now that my Cruyff is on the line. So, um, yeah, let's go and do our left back and right back. I'm going to get torn a new one by Cruyff. Okay then, Andy. So, uh, you went first last time. So, I think it's only fair that I go first this time. And you've got um, Cruyff. So, I think it's only fair that I add in Mbappe and Neymar. I can understand. Yeah, no, that's fair enough, mate. You get them in. You uh, you feel <laughs> you feel free, mate. Um, On the right back spot, I would like to go for Yusuf Atal. If I can have him, because he was very good last year. I remember his team of the season card last year was insane. And he was just a good right back option last year. Then at left back, I think you've written down Region because you do like a bit of Region. So I'm actually going to go with uh, a man I've gotten tradable, Robbo, Andy Robertson. Ooh. If I can have him. You would be correct. I did. You, you wrote down Region. Regulum. Yeah, yeah. I thought you would because the the Dutch, uh, sorry, not the Dutch, the uh, Spurs and the Spanish link up. I just thought it definitely is who you're gonna think. So, however, you haven't said anything about a towel, which makes me think you're gonna be like, but I have wrote down a towel. Well, I'll tell you what. <laughs> you see that a towel, Haber? Yeah. You can have him. <gasps> would be what I would say if he wasn't written on my whiteboard. Get him the hell out of here. That was not nice. That that wasn't nice at all, Andy. You really got you really I, I fist bumped the air. I I honestly believed you. Which goalie am I having? I don't know if to give you a goalie, you know. I don't know if to save my trump card for centre back. Is that Hopefully mental? Not. That is, that sounds a bit mental. If you ask me, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna give you our neighbour. Our neighbour. Who in the? Who is that? Oops. No. I, how? What am I doing here? There you go. Our neighbour. Oh. I hope he's neighbor. got a card because my goalie that you gave me didn't have a card. Did he? So I had to get the goalie from that team. Poor Kalen. You could have at least given me Sizoko. Like that would have been nice of you. <laughs> Musa. Our neighbour. Is he on the market? Let's quickly check. He is. Nice. He's on the market. Nice. Okay. There we go. Our neighbour is in the squad. Okay, Andy. I am holding up my whiteboard for you. Right then. On the left-hand side. Actually, we'll do right first. On the right-hand side, I'll have my red foot champs Florenzi, please. Fair enough. That is a that is a good card. That looks really good. We put out foot champs cards yeah. in Squabbler Showdown. You're sitting here first. What a time to be alive. Fair enough. And then left back, I really want to say, you know what they say, Haber? What? Rules are there to be broken. And then I want to pick this Kamara. However, mm. I feel like you will have clocked onto that and be one step ahead of me. So instead, I'll have Theo Hernandez. Oh. Fair enough. I actually wrote down Falamendi and Saar. Oh, you didn't that, put uh... Kamar. Okay, let's rewind that. Haber, some rules are meant to be broken, <laughs> including the rule of getting two goes at your left back and scoring the shit out. <laughs> Fair enough. No, you are not getting a second choice, Andy. All right, oh. it's not happening. Um, that card does look really good, though. I, the pace downgrade is very interesting. Um, very interesting. So, but yeah, I mean. Did he downgrade his pace to give him more defending, did they, or something like that? Yeah, he, he's down to 84 pace now. Oh, yeah, but he's got um, 83 defending and 83 physical. Yeah, so he looks like a really solid left back, to be fair. Well then, uh, you can have both of them. 
And uh, I've now got to work with uh, my neighbor at right back. Nice. Should we go do the C uh, CBs and goalkeeper? Let's get that trump card in, mate. Okay then, Andy. So, we have the two CBs and the goalkeeper. I went first last time, so it is your turn to go first. All right. Who would you like, mate? There's two ways for me to do this, team. The first one is to put a French Ligue 1 right centre-back and then do a French team. Or I put a Italian Serie A right centre-back and do a Serie A team. Or I put a French Ligue 1 left centre back and do a Ligue 1 team. Oh, three ways. Oh, the jazziness continues. What I'm going to do is on the right hand side, I'm going to go for Chiellini. Go big or go home, as they say. I really, really wanted to get Koulibaly in, but the only way to do it would be to use Napoli's non rare Italian goalkeeper, and that seems like a terrible or idea. Speeder. So, yeah, not, no, it's not even Ospina. It's um, it's an Italian oh, non-rare. Oh, I don't know who he is. It's a strong link to Koulibaly and Chiellini. Mere, sounds like a terrible idea. So, we need a bit of an outlandish Serie A left centre-back and then a strong link to both of them in goal. So, I'm just having a little flick around, trying to see if there's anything sneaky that I can do. But I'm struggling, if I'm honest with you. So I might just pick... I might just pick another... Juve centre-back. Bit of Pimenti Calcio. So I'll have... Delict. And then they both get chemistry. And I can grab any Serie A goalkeeper on the game. So I'll pick... Who would be the most unobvious here? Let's go Paul Lopez. You can have all of them, mate. I wrote down Kimpembe, Laporte and Galaxy. I tried to cover a few bases. I thought you might go Laporte, given that it's a brand new card. Obviously, it was quite obvious, but I thought you might go for it. I thought you might go Kimpembe to get the links. And I put down Galaxy in case you went for it up Meccano slash Konate centre-back um, option. So you can have... Absolutely everyone, you've bamboozled me there. Nice. I need to use my trump card, though. Hopefully, you don't get option two. Okay. So, at right CB, uh, I would like to go for a man whose name starts with a K and ends in Oshelny. Hopefully. I am hoping you put down Kimpembe. At left centre-back, I would like a man whose name starts with a Joe and ends with a Gomez because he's OP. However, again, risky. I felt like you might have wrote down Van Dyke because you know that I've got him. I'm hoping you did anyway. And to link them all together in goal, I would like to go with a bit of Steve Mandanda. So close. Yet so far, I thought, oh, we caused double strong link, Thiago and Robertson. I thought Joe Gomez needed another link, and I thought you were going to go Loris, and I thought I was going to use my trump card in goal. Oh, I was actually going to go with Loris, but I went with uh, oh, you last second, I changed my mind. Instead. Guess I'll just have to use a centre back instead. Did you get both of them? No, I got Koscielny, mate. Damn, I thought you'd go Kimpembe. No! Not another game with no centre-back. Mate, your right side is absolutely well and truly in the mud. Overmars is licking his lips. <laughs> I don't know why I'm looking, actually. I know the, exactly the man for you. Bart, actually, no, I don't. Now, listen. I want you to be really nice about this guy, okay? I want to be really nice to him. Okay. Because he's going to be terrible, but it's not his fault. He is completely innocent. Brilliant. That's just brilliant. <laughs> well then, I am, in, I am in a lot of trouble, and I've got a lot on the line. That was a large brain trump card save. That's what that was. Absolutely panicking. Why didn't I go Kimpembe? 
Yay! I could have gone Kimpembe and Allison. I could have gone with anything but what I went for. And I was like, Kishoni, because he looks cool. <laughs> okay, well done, Andy. Um, I'm going to go and buy Innocent and Joe Gomez and hope that you're very innocent and don't leave a crime scene behind you in this game. I am well and truly panicking, Andy. Gonna lose me club. I am. I'm gonna lose me Cruyff, mate. Oh no. Oh yes. Woo! I don't know how oh, I haven't scored. To be honest with you, if I didn't, if I had that chance in foot champs and didn't score it, I'd be very tilted. There Especially because you've now scored. Memphis. Oh, big oh, save! Oh, you've got to bury that Memphis. I don't know what they actually are. Screw it. Oh my god. Oh my word. That is bloody ridiculous. I, I needed it as well. I needed I needed something. I believe to call that. The new net of order. Peter win. <laughs> <laughs> True. Well, it didn't go in, so maybe they don't. Cruyff! <gasps> Come on, this one's got to go Whoa. in. Oh, Mandanda, stop! <sighs> oh, lads. Innocent, mate. Innocent. Innocent. Oh, no, I'm genuinely so scared right now. I have I have everything, like, my midfielder on stay back while attacking, and they're just rushing up the pitch, and it's leaving me exposed to that. No. Oh, why did I use Cruyff? Oh, that's a goal. Please, Cruyff. Cruyff. Cruyff, yes! How's your Come icon on. scoring? Uh, don't tell me, because it's yours costs three and a half mil, and mine costs 200k. Oh, Gelson. No, man. That pass was so weak. That pass was so weak. Should have put something on that. Like a little bit of chip or something. Give me. No, give. Oh, I've, I've conceded there. I. No. It wouldn't give me a Drissa. It just wouldn't. It wouldn't switch me there at all. That's the bronze, isn't it? No, it's a Drissa gay. Ah. Penref. I can't believe that was a penalty and a red card. I can't believe I tried to Penenkia instead of just smashing in the bottom left like I always do. Wait, how's he not blowing the whistle? Okay, he has. I can't believe I didn't just smash your bottom bins like I always do. I have got the most nerve-wracking next couple of minutes ahead of me. Oh, I could have had two. Why did I not just drill it? I was trying to mug you off so bad. Oh, my word. So it is just one discard, one discard right? Yes, so it's a 1 in oh. 11 chance of bye-bye Cruyff. Do you know, I just don't fancy my chances, though. I don't like these odds. Everywhere <laughs> everywhere I want to put them, right? I can hear your voice saying that position in my head. Literally everywhere. I can just hear you saying it. I'm nervous for you, mate. <laughs> oh, Andy, please don't get in. Please. Are you ready? <sighs> so I'm just saying a prayer. You ready? All right, go on. Go on. Left, centre, mid. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. Oh, he was right, centre, mid. <sighs> Who was it? I'm not even kidding. You got Gelson Martins, mate. I he, like I just discard him because he's worth about 700 coins anyway. <sighs> oh my word! He was right, centre, mid, and I'm not kidding. Like he could have, like I, I, oh, panicking. <sighs> I don't like. I know it's so, like it's so silly because it's only a FIFA card, right? But I'm I've that is genuinely one of the most nerve-wracking times of my life that I've ever experienced is that right there. I think that and like that 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 is hand in hand with like my driving test on how nervous <laughs> I was for that. <laughs> oh, thank goodness gracious. Okay, all right, that's not too bad. That to be fair, like I don't I did not deserve to 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 win that game. No. So like it was, it's it was fair that he got discarded. It's just like if you'd have hit Croft, then that would have been horrible Next for me. Next level that pain, would have been so bad. 
Oh, but that's been Squad Builder Showdown around mid. I mean, around Informed Dubai. <laughs> if you guys did enjoy, please leave a like down below and check out the Informed Marcus Rashford, Sir Marcus Rashford MBE episode we did over on Andy's channel. They should put Sir Marcus Rashford as his FIFA card. That'd be cool. They really should. That would be cool. Anyway, that's been it for Squad Builder Showdown. Thank you all for watching. Check out Andy's episode, and I'll see you later.